I'ma do it like I ain't been done. I'ma do it like I ain't been done. <laughs> My name is Maddie, and welcome to the Madcrafter 101, where we do super cool crafts every single Sunday. I'm so excited for this week's craft. As you can already tell by the title, by the thumbnail, we are doing another crayon melting art project today. And yes, I might have a little obsession with crayons and the amazing things you can do with colored wax, but you know, you can't judge me for it. I don't know. I mean, you can, but that wouldn't be nice. Anyway, I hope you enjoy. So here we go. The first thing you're gonna need is some cardboard, some crayons, vinyl, some kind of writing utensil, a exacto knife, paint, paintbrush, and a hair dryer. And let's begin. The first thing you're gonna want to do is obviously paint your cardboard unless you have a surface already painted. The next thing you want to do is let your paint dry and go ahead and sketch out what you want on your vinyl. You can do pretty much anything and if you are not good at sketching or drawing you can actually print stuff off of the computer and just trace around those. So once you've got that done you can grab your exacto knife and start cutting it out just like this. Be careful with exacto knives if you are young and you haven't used them a lot, be careful what you're doing and I would actually recommend using scissors if you're not used to them. Once you've got it all cut out, you can start popping it out of the outside, I guess. <laughs> and be careful not to rip anything, it's kind of hard. Once you've got that done, you can peel the vinyl off of the backing and start putting it on where you'd like on the cardboard. Once you've got that done, and you have to strip all your crayons first, obviously, and if you grab your X-Acto knife and just kind of put a slit all the way down the wrapping, it's easier to unwrap the crayons. Now this is a really fun part, is where you get to blow dry everything, and now it takes a minute for it to get hot but after it gets warm it's pretty easy and pretty self-explanatory you get used to it and you can make it look however you want and after that you're gonna want to let it dry and then you can start peeling off the vinyl and you should get this really cool awesome looking design but make sure it's cool because it gets real hot that's what it should look like Thank you so much for watching the video. If you liked it, give it a big thumbs up right down below. Comment what your favorite part of the project was, if you did it, if you liked it, if you hated it. Anything you want, right down below. Also, don't forget to subscribe for videos like this every single Sunday and more videos thrown in throughout the week. I am now breathless. And shout out to all of you awesome people who are already subscribed to me right now. I have over 800 subscribers and that's just crazy to me. Like, you might not think it's that much, but with all of you awesome people out there who are subscribed right now, I could fill up a whole gymnasium. And that's so awesome so thank you everyone who subscribed and stuck through and just enjoyed my videos as much as I've enjoyed making them. My next goal is 1,000 subscribers so if you haven't subscribed yet go ahead and help me make my goal. I love you guys. Bye!